Hello from the Ice Village. And welcome to the, uh, well, actually today's the day after the winter solstice because I couldn't quite get my act together yesterday because it was the winter solstice. Um, but look at the amazing map art that, oh, come back here, that uh, Blue Owl made and attempted to give me a ridiculous discount that I blatantly ignored because, oh my goodness, this is amazing. And having tried to do some very simple map art, I very much appreciate how much goes into something like this. Never mind doing such ornate lettering and like this is, yeah. Um, awesome. Thank you, Blue Owl. Um, and yeah, others have added their various homes to the Ice Village. A tree one, which that is actually Blue Owl, I believe. Yes. Yes. Blue Owl's Winter Nest. We've got a castle and a tower of some kind. And I just love how creative everybody's been. Because, um, of course, my imagination said, there are only so many ways I can make a house out of ice and snow. Um, and yet look at all the ways people have come up with to make the house out of ice and snow. Um, yeah. And I don't actually have time to record much today, but I wanted to make sure I at least got that recorded. Um, and, and now I need to go get back to work, like actual work work. Um, so yeah. But, uh, oh, and, uh, Where's Miss Llama? Mistletoe the Christmas... I don't know, have I already visited Mistletoe the Christmas Llama? I'm not entirely sure, because... But you do understand Solstice is within the same week, at least, right? I, I know that the, the dates are different, and, and I don't know what, if anything, anybody did for Hanukkah, but... Um, yeah. So I'll cut back in um, at some point, and who knows at what point I'll be adding stuff because this week is um, hectic. Let's just go with hectic. Yeah. Hello again. And as you can clearly tell by the way all of the chests have turned into various forms of presents, I am recording this on Christmas Day. Actually, they were also like this on Christmas Eve, but I didn't do any real recording. Um, let's go take a look at the Christmas Village first. And, well, not Christmas Village, Ice Village. And then I've been putting together stuff for a project that I'm going to see if I can knock out today. Uh, one of them is actually called Project Box. The other one's just full of all spruce things. Okay, there we go. So yeah, let's go take a look at the Christmas Village. Did I hear footsteps outside? I don't know. It's early morning. There could be creepers. But no. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ooh. Uh, not as early in the day as I had thought, so we're gonna need to take a nap. Um. Let me run to my ice house because. Uh, yeah, oh, here. Ooh, and I have a gift, but we'll look at that in the morning. And, oh, hello, Enderman person. I'm not going to be able to sleep. Um, um, 
Um, I'm gonna borrow somebody else's bed. How is he in there? Like, I thought I had actually spawn proofed that. Um, okay. Not sure how that happened, but whatever. Um, okay, so I have a gift. Um, even though my holiday is winter solstice, which is already passed, I am totally down with celebrating things that involve gifts. And apparently I have been naughty, so I got coal. Huh. Well, I have something that says the naughty list. And it's by Mistletoe the Christmas Llama. Yeah, I do say so. Okay. During the festive season, we buy this festive plant. Can the wrapped up gifts beneath be opened early? No, they can't. So this is a riddle entitled naughty list, question mark, exclamation point, question mark. I'm thinking that's the festive plant over there. Possibly that one. Well, let, that one's closer, so let's check there first. But um, the only thing really underneath it is a very chipped anvil. So um, the coal is actually more useful than that. So um, I hope that's not it. I hope it's that one. Because that one's all like lit up and stuff. That, that seems a little more festive. Yeah, let's go with that. Ooh, somebody left the door open. Anybody in here who's not supposed to be? Like more Endermen or better still Creepers because y'all can climb ladders. Well, Endermen can teleport, but okay. No, good. Okay. So it looks like this might be the place. And we've got a, a candy cane going up the middle to various floors. All right. Well, let's see what this book tells me. Um, actually, let me take the book. Which is, you figured out the riddle by Mistletoe the Christmas Llama. Okay. Bwah, bwah. Did you think you were on the naughty list? Of course not. I know 2020 has been a hard year, so I had to make a little joke. The players of the Greenhouse SMP are some of the nicest people I have ever known. With the help of my elves, we brought a little gift to hopefully make you smile. While some celebrate different holidays from Christmas, Hanukkah to the winter solstice, we can all come together and enjoy each other's company. May 2021 be a year that brings you intense joy, oh, immense joy and happiness. Wah, wah. That That is a great imitation of llama speak, can I just say. All right, so we, we have stuff, stuffs up here. Um, ah, get off the ladder. And banana shrimp, barbarian job. Okay, so we're in alphabetical order, so I am probably not on this level. TSA girl, evil shoes, history Wes, and Aletha and Aspie, so we're back to the A's. So let's go up a level. Oh, and I'm right here. Okay, then. Aha! Lots of cool stuff. Happy Holidays 2020. Ha <laughs> ha! It's an elf banner. I get a huge kick out of that movie. And lots of really cool things. We've got pumpkin pie, which I love. Christmas cookies. Some cake. Some roses, because, of course, greenhouse, Stina Rose, rose bushes. Uh, golden carrots, very useful to have. Chorus fruit, also very handy. 
for making end rods, primarily, from my point of view, but I think you can also do other things with them. Baked potato to munch on, chorus flower, if you need to start a chorus farm. <laughs> Potion of snow falling as opposed to slow falling, because of course, that is what we would call it on this server, because yes. And Potion of Healing, very good to have. Some sweet berries and some candy, not just apples, because I have apples, but candy apples, even better. Let me put my, come on, let me put my banner back for now. Um, actually, no, I'm going to bring my banner to my ice house. What time is it? It's noon. I should be fine other than Marvin is probably still in my ice house. go. Okay, Marvin left. Marvin was standing on carpet. All right, the, these are not one full block wide because of the trap doors. There's a trap door there, carpet, carpet, carpet. Trap door, trap door, carpet, carpet, trap door, trap. How was Marvin even in here? I don't understand. Oh, must have come in through there? I guess. I don't know. I'm confused. But anyway. Very festive. You know what? That should be my thumbnail. So let's do that. Uh, actually, I want to stand on the side with the Winter Solstice map that Blue Owl made, which I am still absolutely over the moon about because that's just awesome. So let's see if we can get the banner, the map, and there we go. That'll make a great screenshot. Ooh, and then there was Blue Owl's um, ice tray back there. Winter Nest. Very neat. Oh, I love the icicles and everything. So cool. Okay, now let's get out of here before the sun goes back down and more things start spawning in. Ew, would help if I ate.
that's it. I think I'm satisfied with my new phantom hunting grounds. It's gonna be interesting during editing to see what these switches in and out of spectator did on replay mod. Now I have... I like the acacia accent in the original build it didn't make sense to change the fence coloring coming out here even though i kind of wanted it to be the warped instead and i do like acacia with spruce so i don't know we'll see whether this grows on me or whether i decide i need to change it but now i have places that i can be you know shooting phantoms from up high Nothing can get up here. It's all nicely spawn proofed within the fences. There's a few slips that, oh, I have to make these last two longer so they match. Um, but where you can pull in a boat, if it's your shift to come work the watch watchtower, then you park your boat there and come on up. Yeah. I think I'm I think I'm happy with that. And uh, that is much more time than I expected to spend Christmas Day building, but I I'm home and we did most of our stuff last night for Christmas Eve with my family. So and my holidays really solstice which was a few days ago anyway. Definitely liking this light overlay mod that gives me the the yellow X's or the red X's to tell me is it spawnable now or is it going to be spawnable when the sun goes down? Because um, now I know everything is spawn proof up here. The one patch I had was here, and so now it's got a nothing underground. Yeah, I'm very happy with that. I can't take off my armor to say goodbye because I have a mess in my inventory. This is going to be fun to fix. Let's just do all of that. Okay. Now I can say, uh, from the front of my new watchtower. So for now, I guess I will say, um, that's it. And until next time, I hope you have had wonderful holidays and that you have a wonderful new year, assuming you're watching this sometime around the time this is being recorded, or just that you have a wonderful day. Bye!